In this video, we will learn about the reset restart function of the G100. The reset restart function automatically resets the trip and restarts if the terminal block operation command is on after a trip condition. This function can be used when you want to automatically reset an intermittent trip and restart it. However, please be aware of safety precautions, as the trip is automatically reset and the motor will restart. Next, let's see how to program the reset restart function. In order to use the reset restart function in G100, the command source in the operation group DRV parameter must be set to the terminal block operation command method of number 1 FXRX1 or number 2 FXRX2. Next, set PR group number 8 parameter to number 1 yes to activate the reset restart function. After setting the number of restart attempts in parameter 9 of PR group, set the restart delay time in the 10 parameter of the PR group. All settings are entered to enable this function. Let's see how to set the reset restart parameter using the G100 keypad. The operation method can be set in the operation group DRV parameter. And to use the reset restart function, it must be set as a terminal block. So, let's set it to number 1 FXRX1. The frequency command setting method can be set in the operation group FRQ. And in this video, we will set it with number 0 keypad 1. Next, you need to set parameters related to automatic restart. After changing PR8 to number 1 yes to activate the auto reset and restart after a trip. Set the number of automatic restart attempts on PR9 and set delay time of automatic restart on PR10. In this video, the number of automatic restarts is set to 2 and the automatic restart delay time is set to 5 seconds. Now set one of the multifunction input terminals to external trip to create a trip condition for the test. In this video, we will set P4 terminal as external trip. The function setting of the P4 terminal can be set in in-group 68. The following is a list of things to check when the automatic restart function does not work properly. First, the reset restart function operates only when the command source of the terminal block is on. If the terminal block command source is turned off, the function does not work, so be sure to check if the command source is on. Also, if the P4 terminal set as external trip is on, the trip status continues and restart is not possible. Therefore, it must be opened after generating an external trip. Next, we will proceed with the test under the parameter conditions set earlier. First, turn on the P1 terminal to operate the motor. Make a trip condition by turning on the P4 terminal. When the trip message appears on the LCD keypad and the motor stops, open up the P4 terminal from its closed state. Since external trip is a latch type trip, the trip is not cancelled even if P4 terminal is open or turned off. It automatically resets 5 seconds after the trip occurs, and the motor starts because the P1 terminal is on. Repeat several times in the same way. Set 
Since the number of restarts was previously set to 2, it can be seen that when the third external trip occurs, it does not restart even if P4 terminal is turned off. We have learned how to reset restart function. Thank you.